there and thanks for your interest in applying to the Head Start program at Champaign County, Illinois. So to help you out a little bit, I wanted to show you our application and let you know some things you might want to have with you whenever you're applying. So on this front page, the cover page, it shows everything you'll need whenever you apply. We're going to need a completed application. We're going to need the birth certificate of any children that you're applying for. And then we're also going to need income verification for you or for your partner or any adult that lives in the household with you. Come closer and I'll show you. Right here is everything you need to know. It has all of the information written down for you. And then a little bit lower down, it lists all the different program options that we have at our site. So here on this first page is everything that you would need to fill out for the child that you're applying for. Don't worry, if you have multiple children that you're applying for, we'll give you a separate page for each one. Then on the back page here, it has a list of all the different program options we have at Champaign County. We've got several, family child care, home-based services, and then five different sites. We have school day and we have full day and all the way through ages six weeks to five years old. On this page here is where you'll fill out your information, the parent. It has everything to where you're the mother, father figure, um, if you're working, if you're in school, if you're in a training program at all. And then the next page is the exact same and it's for the second parent. If there's not a second parent living with you in the household, then you can just leave it blank. Then on this last page here, it's just some general family information for you. It's got what type of family household you have, if you've received any services from Champaign County or otherwise, your housing, and importantly, any information that you can provide about a stressful situation. Don't worry, this information is confidential and it only helps to improve your priority um, on the wait list. Then this last page here, is listed for any other children that is in the household that you're not applying for, whether they're um, not eligible because of their age or any other reason. And then finally, you'll just sign and date right there. And that's it. That's how you fill out the application. If you have any questions though, feel free to call any of our sites. Thanks and we hope to hear from you soon.